Hi there, it's Sarah. Welcome back to my channel, The Empowered Light Leader. And I'm going to deliver a message for you today, July 7th, as well as a light language transmission and a powerful meditation visualization exercise. So let's take a nice deep breath. Feel into the energy. Today is all about being pushed. Okay, we are being pushed forward. So what does this mean? You know, this means that anything that is not in alignment of our highest, best truth is of old, is all crumbling down. And you can see this, of course, in, you know, the world, right? You can see this in the planet from a collective larger level, but it is breaking down in your day-to-day -day life. Old cycles, periods, revolutions, cycles of energy are coming full circle now and you're entering a newer cycle. Now, I'm not an astrologer, okay? But I'm intuitive and I'm a channel and I feel that whatever is going on astrologically is in accordance with this, is pushing, pushing, pushing us forward. You're being pushed, I'm being pushed, I can feel it. It's uncomfortable, it's scary. Remember, 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 and this is for me as well. This is for your highest, best good. In order to rise into the potential of who you are, you must let go of the chains, the chains of suffering, right? We've talked about suffering, the chains of martyrdom, the chains of struggle. Now, this doesn't mean you're not gonna have challenges, right? Because we're here to look at our darkness, heal, heal that energy so we can move forward into our highest potential. But we don't need to struggle through it. We certainly don't need to suffer through it. Okay, so whatever appears to be frightening now, scary, unknown, ride the wave, <laughs> bear with it. I'm right there with you, okay? It can be scary when you are you know, being asked to let go of everything that is once familiar, right? And enter a phase of your life, a new phase of your life, where in your heart, you know that's, you know, you know you know, right? That's what you're meant for, but yet there's the old energy, the fear, right? And there may be people who do not like right? They don't like but they just aha, you speaking your truth, you rising in your power, you letting go, you making new decisions from boundaries. They may react harshly to that. But it's only because it's unfamiliar to them, how you were before was convenient for them. But you're not fulfilling a role for anyone else now. Yes, you fulfill a role for service, but you fulfill a role for yourself first. You step into your power. You emanate that light. You're not here right, to be chained to suffering, chained to illusion, chained to other people's manipulation. You're here to return to know who you are. So in that process, you know, as you come to more understanding of that truth, you see through other people's lies and manipulations. And of course, they're not going to like that, right? Because it, it doesn't, the old tactics, the old tools, don't work on you anymore. So remember again, today, July 7th, and again, this message is applicable for any time you listen to it. Right? Everything is always in divine time. We're being pushed. Where are you being pushed? So breathe. Let's do a little visualization. And I'll bring in a little bit more light language to support you in that journey forward. So breathe into those uncomfortable spaces. Where do you feel pushed? Right? Where do you feel on the edge? Where do you feel uncomfortable? And right? instead of leaning away lean into that feel see sense if you can lean into that with love right if you can lean into that with recognition if you can re really lean into that i see you i feel you you're safe so lean into those uncomfortable places where you feel like you're being pushed where you don't feel that you're safe <sighs> breathe and lean in and feel the safety of that and then as you lean in and feel safe to explore those places and trust and know that you're being pushed really for your highest best good then I want you to lean back 
<sighs> feels so nice. So as you lean forward, you lean with love, right? Into recognizing whatever's coming forward needs to be seen by you. And you lean forward with, you know, awareness, with love, you recognizing you're safe, and then you lean back with surrender and trusting that you're held. Lean forward with love, lean back with surrender and trust. You're held, you're safe as you move forward. Embrace the push, right? And then surrender to it. You are so much more than your physical situation. Remember that. It's very challenging when you live right where you live so go to nature go to those places that enliven you that reunite you that reawaken you do not go to these places you know with guilt for taking time for yourself go with these places with a tender heart Go with these places with an open spirit. that you feel is the universe working with you it's you working with you yes yeah, so imagine you yes the future version of you supporting you now holding you now giving you advice now what would he or she say to you you've made it through the other side what what support what guidance can they give you right now stay in that space dear ones Sunu kutu suma, sunu to karma suna. Arikiseya, you are ready. Trust, trust that you are ready. Even if you don't have anything planned, the universe is planning with you and for you. Takarame shise sumu kutu suma. You are so much more than you know. The kisse maha, the karisse maha. Remember the truth of that. Beautiful, taking a nice deep breath. So, ultimately, the message is for today. We are being pushed. The old is crumbling. We are entering a new phase of creation, a new phase of our life. How do you want to go into that new phase? You want to lean in and lean back. So we lean in with awareness and love, and we lean back with surrender and faith, right? We lean in with awareness and love, and we lean back. And again, put yourself forward. Talk to the, to the future version of yourself. What would they say to you now to support you in this moment? So that is the message for today. Again, you can listen to this whenever. Thank you so much for being part of my community. If you haven't already, please subscribe so that you'll get notified if you click that little bell when I make a new video, which is, you know, three to four times a week. And I have exciting news. I have a light language healing circle coming up. I will leave the link for that in the description. You're welcome to join that. And I'll be there live. It is a healing circle, so it is not a class. Is a healing circle so if you want to practice your light language is the perfect place for you and if you want to receive high frequency high vibrational healing it is a perfect place for you so that is i have two times for that and you can get all the info in that in that link again thank you for subscribing please share like spread the love and thank you for helping me raise the vibration of the planet sending you much love Bye.